Hey guys, I am back. It is week 10 of this Fat 2 Figure Competitor Prep, and I'm here this week to give you guys some updates. So I'm down two pounds since the last weigh-in, so bringing my weight to 131. Really excited, and I think next week I'm gonna be checking in with my coach, so I'll continue to give you guys some physique updates, which you can also see um, on my Instagram page. Um, but my energy was really, really good for the last five days. I really cranked out some good workouts, and then it was like my energy plummeted again. So um, it's been really, really tough. And I'm trying to push as much as I can, but man, I get so tired. This prep is definitely harder than I thought, um, but I'm gonna keep pushing through no matter what. But um, those are like the biggest portions of my update this week. Um, I'm also going to be um, sharing my workout split with you guys this week. And then I'm gonna be sharing how I make a lower carb oatmeal now that I'm eating less carbs on this prep. And then, um, I have been looking for my figure competition suit this week. So um, Angel Competition Bikinis is my sponsor and I am beyond blessed to have them as my sponsor. Um, but I am gonna be picking out my suit extremely soon here. So please stay um, you know, posted to see what the suit is going to be. Hey guys, what up? It's Eve. I'm going to show you guys how I make my oatmeal that I love to have on leg day. So let's do this. So here's the ingredients we're going to be using. We've got some blueberries, some sugar-free vanilla syrup, some organic uh, coconut palm sugar. Yours doesn't have to be organic. Some rolled oats, and this is optional. This is fresh um, ground honey peanut butter from Fresh Time, and then it's the morning. This is a real video, and so shout out to my herbal concentrate tea for helping to boost my metabolism to get me pumped through this morning. It also helps bur me burn 80 to 100 calories per serving, and it gets me energized for my day. So let's do this, peeps. All right, so we're gonna be starting off with a fourth a cup of oats. So those are going in there, and then whatever you have for your volume of oats, make, make sure you have double that in water. So water is going in there, give it a stir, and then we're gonna do about one teaspoon of this organic coconut palm sugar. This kind of mimics the taste of brown sugar, and so I don't have to use a bunch of carbs from this because I am going lower carb. I'm doing one packet of stevia, and then for a little bit of creaminess, instead of regular milk, we're gonna do a splash of the sugar-free vanilla sweetener. There we go, and then get the stirring. So then we're gonna pop this baby in the microwave for 90 seconds. Taking out the oatmeal. Oh my God, that's super hot. Like, I'm going to burn my hands <laughs> like Jesus but that brings me to the next thing so I've got 20 grams of blueberries weighed out I typically will grab the frozen because they stay um, fresher longer so I'm gonna put these in here and kind of push them down just a little bit and as the oatmeal is cooling and you can tell this is thick I like mine thicker so use more water if you want you can always add water in the end but I want um, some of the heat to kind of make these blueberries burst a little bit. So we'll do that and in the process of waiting on that, we're gonna cook some egg whites because I typically make sure that I have protein along with carbs before leg day. All right, here we go. Non-stick spray, give it a good spray. No, I do not track my um, non-stick spray in my fitness pal. Um, I pre-measured out four ounces of egg whites. Make sure you let it coat all the way around the pan and then pick your choice of seasoning. I love this everything but the bagel sesame seasoning because it's got salt, salt, garlic, and onion already in there. Only 80 milligrams of salt and it's kind of a one-step seasoning for when I'm like, let's hurry up and just go. Make sure it kind of covers. 
covers the side too. So here's the back of this coconut palm sugar so you guys can see. One teaspoon is only four grams of carbs, so why not? But let me show you how I get this honey butter measured accurately. I'm only putting a half tablespoon in today, and that's about um, seven grams. So I do it this way because whatever is on the spoon and then I lick <laughs> will also be part of what I need. Boom, that's it. The rest, this is for me. I like my egg whites to come off in like one piece. I don't typically like chop them all up or anything, but. This be them. You know what? Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> Here we go, egg whites. Creamy blueberry oatmeal with honey butter on top. And I will have all of the information, including the macros, in the link below. So, I wanted to show you guys some of the suits I've been looking at with my sponsor, um, Angel Competition Bikini. So this is like the page for the figure suits. And a while ago, I did post like some of the suits I was looking at. But in the comments below, let me know what suits you guys like the most. Like if you click on one, this is like an example design, but then there's others down in here. So like, here's another one. Let's go up. Look at that, I kinda like that color. I don't know if this one would look good on my skin. These are cute too, I like these designs. Look at the swirls. Let's see what other colors are in there. Wow. Their products look so good. Look at that one, wow. This one is really nice too. I like like this gradient look. This is like mermaid looking. But I'm picking a suit this week and I can't wait to show you guys what my final choice is. But again, down in the comments, let me know what colors you think I should get. And then I will do a reveal as we um, head towards show day hey guys i am on my computer working on my workout split for week 10 and i treat myself just like a client i create my own splits i write workouts based on what i currently look like and what um, i need to be doing to get to how i need to look on the stage so i'm going to show you guys um, the workout split that I'm doing right now um, because I want to show you guys that I treat myself just like my clients. I have a plan. I just don't go in there and wing it. I have to have something that is laid out as a blueprint for me to get to where I need to be. All right, so this is my workout split from last prep when I was um, 10 weeks out. So see it there. It says 10 weeks out. So this was the split I was doing. And these were the exercises that I needed to focus on um, the most. So this was like my Monday through Sunday. And then now I'm updating my split again. And this is the split I'm currently on. Quads on Monday, shoulders on Tuesday, back and biceps Wednesday, Thursday, hamstrings, chest and triceps on Friday and Saturday will be like my makeup day for anything I need to hit more. I'm growing my shoulders so I'll do some of that on Saturday and then I'll do the hit cardio. I'm just starting to add that in and so what I'm going to be doing today is writing in what exercises I need to focus on to build my muscles the way that I need them to look. So if I need to work on my um, the back of my shoulder muscles 
I'll put more delts in here. If I need to work on my V for my back, I'll have more like wider grip things that I'm going to add in here. Thanks again, you guys, for tuning in to my channel this week, getting my week 10 updates. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys for the update for week number nine.